Hi everyone, so I wanted to produce this quick video uh, regarding the rotor screw um, and uh, it, you know, it goes right here and this is where it goes through your rotor. So it got stripped by this uh, T30 bit and this is a Volkswagen jet I'm working on for a friend changing the rotors and pads. So you see, you probably see that line there and are wondering what's going on there. So what I did was I took my metal grinder and then I just did a quick, you know, quick drill right into that. And literally I had this out in about 30 seconds. So after I drilled that line, the whole point is, or the idea is to be able to put a screwdriver in there. And then I just got it in there. So much like leverage in there. Cause I, I dug it. You don't want to go too deep. You don't want to, you know, break the screw. So just enough to get it. And then I got it out and uh, that's it. And just uh, literally like 30 seconds, man, people are like saying drill through it. You don't need to drill into it. Just do what I did. A metal grinder will, if you have the metal grinder. Um, and then I just want to give a piece of advice. I see videos on YouTube of people working on cars, not using gloves like these. Go to Harbor Freight. I got these today on special for $5.99. Save your hands, man. I cannot believe for the life of me, people work on their cars with their bare hands. It's nasty. So... Anyway, that's my two cents on this. I hope it helps you out. Later.